From Case Western Reserve University, this is the Research Report, highlighting discoveries for life. For people with diabetes, insulin delivered through a pump or injection is a lifesaver. But insulin starts to degrade at high temperatures. When insulin is kept above room temperature, it forms a tangle, something like Elmer's glue. Dr. Michael Weiss heads up a research team at the Case Western Reserve University School of Medicine in Cleveland. They've made a major discovery that could help patients with diabetes, especially in developing countries where the only option is to bury insulin in the ground to keep it cool. I traveled to East Africa and saw the healthcare challenges of patients with diabetes that lack access to refrigeration or even electricity. Through years of research and trials, Dr. Weiss's team developed a new type of insulin that can withstand temperatures over 100 degrees. This ultra-stable insulin would not only benefit developing countries, it could save lives in natural disasters and power outages throughout the world. And the new insulin has led to another breakthrough, development of a pump that could be inserted inside a human where storage of insulin hasn't been possible due to high body temperature. What we're talking about is an implantable system that needs to be refilled only every three or four months. Weiss's new insulin is being prepared for clinical trial. If successful, it could change the way people with diabetes live their lives. An ultra-stable insulin would allow freedom of movement for taking vacations, going on camping trips, going on bike trips, and not having the necessity of refrigeration. Diabetes is a lifelong disease, and we want to keep people healthy and active for the many decades of their lives. This is the Research Report from Case Western Reserve University. For more discoveries for life, visit case.edu.